Imagine a single system that not only recognizes images with unparalleled precision, but also harnesses the power of creativity to generate stunning visuals beyond imagination. Say hello to Massachusetts Institute of Technology's latest creation, Mass Generative Encoder, or MAGE, the ultimate answer to your AI dreams. How did MIT's Computer Science and Artificial Intelligence Laboratory achieve this groundbreaking breakthrough? And is it really a game changer in the AI realm? Or could the claims of endless applications for MAGE be too good to be true? Listen in as we give you the down low on AI. MIT has been making waves since its inception in 1861, and it's showing no signs of slowing down. It is renowned for its scientific and technological prowess, providing top-notch education and research opportunities. But did you know that it started as a land-grant college way back in 1863? That's right, it's been pushing boundaries and breaking barriers for well over a century. And that's not all. MIT's Computer Science and Artificial Intelligence Laboratory over CSAIL recently celebrated a landmark event honoring its remarkable 60-year anniversary. Imagine 60 brilliant minds, startup pioneers, and AI experts from CSAIL and Imagination in Action, all gathering to share mind-bending ideas and inspiring talks. This conference is the bridge between groundbreaking AI innovations and practical applications, a melting pot of visionary insights and perspectives. Now, imagine a compact, adaptable, and efficient solution that tackles the challenges faced by traditional deep learning models. Well, that's precisely what MIT CSAIL has cooked up. These ingenious networks are addressing some of the inherent limitations that hinder traditional models using liquid neural networks. Now, you might wonder, what makes liquid neural networks stand out from the crowd? They're perfect for areas where traditional models struggle, such as robotics and self-driving cars. Just imagine a robot with the brains of a genius, but without the need to rely on the cloud for its incredible insights. Did you know that the mastermind behind Liquid Neural Networks is none other than Daniela Russ, the brilliant director of MIT CSAIL? She and her team were inspired by the safety-critical systems that robots and edge devices present. After all, you can't expect a tiny robot to handle the mammoth computations of a large language model. That's like fitting an elephant into a matchbox. But wait, there's more. Russ and her collaborators also found inspiration in small organisms like the C. elegans worm, which manages to perform complex tasks using only 302 neurons. Taking a cue from Mother Nature herself, they created the marvel that is liquid neural networks. Now let's talk about their latest mind-blowing creation, Meet Mage, the ingenious masked generative encoder, here to revolutionize the world of image generation and recognition. Did you know this revolutionary framework developed by CSAIL is a groundbreaking breakthrough? No longer will you have to deal with the hassle of training two separate systems for image recognition and generation. Mage's unified approach promises a galaxy of possibilities, streamlining your workflows like never before. Imagine the endless applications, from improving photo processing to crafting stunning art. It's like having an artistic genius at your fingertips. The brilliant minds behind Mage, however, are already working to expand its capabilities, pushing the boundaries of what's possible in the world of computer vision. As with any technology, perfection takes time, but with MIT's determination, the future is looking brighter than ever. Building image generation and recognition systems used to involve two distinct processes. First, there's the generative modeling, where the system learns to create detailed images from simpler inputs like class labels, text embeddings, or random noise. Then there's the self-supervised representation learning, which takes a high-dimensional image and creates a low-dimensional representation for feature detection and classification. These two techniques are powerful on their own, but what if we combined them into a unified architecture? That's exactly what Mage does. Now, here's the magic behind Mage. Imagine taking an image and breaking it down into smaller abstracted versions represented by somatic tokens, like mini jigsaw puzzle pieces. Each token stands for a 16 by 16 pixel patch of the original image. It's like we're teaching the system to see an image in a whole new light. And once these tokens are ready, some of them are randomly masked, creating a challenging guessing game for a neural network. This clever network is then trained to predict the hidden tokens by gathering context from the surrounding ones. It's like May just playing peekaboo with the data. And through this fun process, it learns to understand the intricate patterns in an image, making it a master of image recognition. But here's the kicker. It doesn't stop there. 
Mage also gains the ability to generate new images, breathing life into the realm of image generation. This simple but incredible effective approach enables Mage to smoothly combine generative training and representation learning within the same framework. Imagine having the best of both worlds, the ability to create stunning images from scratch and the finesse to understand and represent existing ones all in one seamless package. It's like having a superpower in the realm of image processing. The researchers behind Mage put their brilliance on paper and they summed it up perfectly. Our key insight in this work is that generation is viewed as reconstructing images that are 100% masked, while representation learning is viewed as encoding images that are 0% masked. It's like they cracked the code for achieving the perfect balance between generation and representation. Now, get ready to be amazed because Mage doesn't stop there. It goes beyond just conjuring images from thin air. This genius system also supports something called conditional image generation. So, if you've got a specific image in mind, Mage can whip it up for you tailored exactly to your wishes. How cool is that? But that's not all. Did you know that Mage can take a whole image as input and work its magic to understand and recognize the image, even identifying its class? It's like having a mind reader at your service. Now imagine this, you've got an image with some sneaky partial crops, but don't worry, for Mage, it can work its wizardry and recover the missing parts, making the image whole again. It's like solving an artistic puzzle piece by piece until the masterpiece is complete. You can also challenge Maze to create a random image for you. Yeah, you heard that right. The system can tap into its vast creative reserves and present you with a unique and unexpected masterpiece. Now, here's a fun fact for you. When Mage is pre-trained on the massive ImageNet image database containing a staggering 1.3 million images, it scores a jaw-dropping 9.1 on the Fresh Shade Inception Distance Scale. Whoa! This score is used to measure the quality of images, and let me tell you, Mage is a true superstar in this aspect, outshining all its predecessors. And wait till you hear this. When it comes to recognition, this impressive AI marvel achieves an outstanding 80.9% accuracy rating in linear probing. That's like having a photographic memory and never forgetting a single face. But hold on, the excitement doesn't end there. Mage also wows us with its tenacity in handling limited labeled data. With just 10 labeled examples from each class, it still manages to attain an astonishing 71.9% 10-shot accuracy rating. And here's the really cool part. Mage isn't just limited to the gigantic ImageNet dataset. Oh no, it can scale up and handle any unlabeled image dataset with ease. Imagine its potential in emerging technologies where labeled data might be scarce. But wait, there's even more magic to this system. The generation side of Mage is no less remarkable. Picture this, it can edit images like a pro, perform visual effects, and dabble in post-production like a seasoned artist. Oh, and it doesn't stop there. Mage can also remove elements from images while keeping everything else realistic. And if that's not enough, it can replace elements with entirely new ones. Talk about having an image genie in a bottle. This groundbreaking research has been a dream come true for many in the field of computer vision. Hui Sheng Wang, a senior software engineer at Google who participated in the Mage project, couldn't contain his excitement. Mage is like nothing we've ever seen before. Combining image generation and recognition in one system is a game changer, and it's smashing records left and right. Mage's applications are limitless. From niche industries to cutting edge technologies, this system is a game changer. And that's not all. Brace yourselves for more amazing news. The team behind Mage is already planning to take this revolutionary system to even greater heights. They want to streamline the token conversion process to preserve the all nitty gritty details of the images, no more losing information along the way. The Mage team is also gearing up to tackle real world, massive unlabeled image data sets. Yeah, we're talking about taking on the big leagues. And if that's not ambitious enough, they're even planning to venture into multi-modality tasks. Think image to text and text to image generation. Oh, <laughs> the possibilities are endless. The impact of Mage is already sending ripples through the computer vision community. Experts and engineers are in all of its groundbreaking approach, merging image recognition and generation into one unified system. This fusion of capabilities has opened up a world of possibilities, inspiring future works that we can't even fathom yet. Which feature of Mage's generation side excites you the most? Realistic image editing or element replacement? 
And can you imagine any specific real world applications where Mage's unique abilities could be a game changer? Leave your answers in the comment section below and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Thank you for watching. We'll see you guys soon.